Found object puppetry or junk puppets. Hello, puppeteers. It's Mr. Davis, your drama teacher. And Miss Lanehart, your art teacher. Thank you for joining us for lesson three of found object puppetry. We've really enjoyed seeing the photos and the videos that you've sent in. I've loved looking at how you've constructed your puppets using different colors and shapes of things, things you found for eyes. You've really made some amazing found object art and turned them into puppets. Great job, artists. And today we're gonna to look at exploring the character of our puppets and give you some ideas to help you tell stories about and with your puppets. And the first thing we're gonna do is an interview where we ask your puppet questions. You can ask your puppet questions or you can ask someone else to ask those questions. And then we're going to play with what your puppet does during the course of a day. Let's get started. Puppet. I'm, I'm wondering if I could interview you. Oh, well, oh, sure, that, that would be nice. What would you like to know about me? Well, first of all, I'm wondering if you have a name. What's your name? Oh, of course, yes. My name is Sparkle because I love to clean. My first question is, what do you like to eat? Oh, well, I love bananas, everything bananas, like Banana flavored jelly beans. <laughs> and um, well, what do you like to do? Well, like I said, I love to clean and I have my scrub brush with me and I just love to go around scrub, 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 scrub. Oh, well, that's great. Um, I'm also wondering, is there something you don't like to do? Well, I really, really don't like to ice skate. Oh, why is that? Because, you see, I have no feet. It's very hard to get the skates on. So hard. Well, yes, yeah, sometimes I just scoot across the ice like this. I can just run and scoot across the ice. But um, wearing those ice skates is really a problem for me. So I just don't like, I just don't like it. Another question. What's something you're afraid of? <gasps> oh, well, I'm really quite afraid of falling pine cones. Um, okay, next question. Do you have any friends? Oh, yes, my favorite friend right now is my friend Roly Poly. You might have seen him in the video at the beginning of the Found Object Puppetry lesson. Yeah, Roly Poly. And, and what do you and Roly Poly like to do? Well, he rolls around and I follow him and he finds things for me to clean. We really have a great time. Oh yes, cleaning is so much fun. Scrub, 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 scrub. Sparkle, well, it was so nice to meet you. Yes, so nice to meet you too. I've got to be going now. Well, thanks for sharing. <laughs> Another possibility would be to have somebody else interview your puppet. You could have somebody at home interview your puppet, or maybe even on class Zoom, you could have one of your friends interview your puppet. I'm going to show you now how I will do an interview of Mr. Davis's puppet. Uh, hello? Hello, hey puppet. Oh, uh, hello. Hi, hey, uh, do you mind if I interview you? Interview, what is an interview? <laughs> well, an interview, uh, I will just ask you some questions. I'd like to get to know you a little bit. Oh, sure, go ahead. <laughs> oh. Oh, well, great, great. First of all, what is your name? My name is XO, 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 XO. Great, great. And um, XO, uh, what do you like to eat? Oh, 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 what do I like to eat? I like to eat marshmallows. Uh -huh. And um, what's something you like to do, Exo? Oh, well, I like to sniff. <laughs> and I like to go for walks in the woods sniffing. 
Oh, I see. All right. What's something you really don't like to do? Oh, uh, well, I, I don't like to fall. Uh, oh, yeah. 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 Falling over is, it's very difficult and sometimes doesn't feel very good. Right, right, right. I understand that. Uh -oh, oh, oh, no. Oh, oh, no. Oh, oh, oh. Uh-oh. Oh, hang in there, XL. Ah! No, no. Oh, no, it's happened. What should I do? Uh. Can you get back up? Oh. oh, oh, no. No wonder you don't like to fall over. Oh, oh that's not very fun. Oh, okay, I'm, I'm back. Yeah, so it was really nice to meet you, XO. Thanks for, thanks for letting me give you an interview. Oh, well, thanks for asking. It's nice to meet you, too. Let's think about what does your puppet like to do in a day? A day in the life of your puppet. Now, remember, as a puppeteer, I'm going to keep my focal point on my puppet. I'm going to think about how can I hold my puppet so that if I have an audience, they can see it. And I'm going to think about how can I show my puppet breathing, looking and seeing the world around it, and moving. Ooh. And remember, you can give a voice to your puppet as well. All right, let's see, how is my puppet gonna sleep? I think my puppet sleeps on its side. And even when we're sleeping, we're breathing, right? How can you show your puppet sleeping? Oh, maybe you have a bed or maybe there's a blanket for your puppet. <laughs> Little blanky. Maybe your puppet snores. Oh, oh. Uh, how does your puppet wake up? Oh, stretch. Uh. I am hungry for some breakfast. Ooh, ooh, I think I'm going to have my favorite cereal, Toasty Oasty Roasty Toasty O's. Delicious. I'm ready for the day. What does your puppet like to eat for breakfast? And what does your puppet like to do during the day? I think I'll go for a walk. Oh, what's that? Watch that. bird. Oh, wait a minute. I'm a puppet. I can do anything. I can fly. <laughs> Whoa, I love flying. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I can tumble too. <laughs> what does your puppet like to do during the day? I, I wonder what my friend Jojo is doing. <sighs> maybe I'll, maybe I'll call him. Doop, 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 doop. Jo, Jo, do you have another puppet you can play with too? Boom, 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 boom. Hello, friend. 
Hey, Jojo, let's go see what's going on down at the playground. Yeah, okay. Boom, boom, whoop, 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 boom, boom, whoop, 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 boom, boom, whoop, 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 whoop. What else does your puppet like to do during the day? Maybe your puppet goes to work somewhere. Hmm. Well, I suppose I should have some dinner now, too. <laughs> cook, 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 my favorite. Uh, milk and hot dogs. <laughs> oh, I am ready for bed. Oh, oh, where, hey, where's my blanket? Here's your blanket. Oh, Nighty night world, have sweet dreams. So artists, you have been a performing artist. You've been doing drama when you've been acting with these puppets. You can also do some drawing with your puppets. You could draw panels like we did with the comic art in your sketchbook or on a piece of paper. And you could draw out the stories that you're acting out with your puppet. You can put those into drawings and put them in panels in your sketchbook. You can also do some drawing from observation. Your puppet is a very interesting object with interesting shapes and textures, and it would be really fun to do a portrait of your puppet. So I'm set up now for a drawing from observation. I've got my puppet where I can see it easily, and I'm going to follow the drawing cycle. Observe, plan, practice, and draw. I observe that this puppet is full of circles and has some other interesting shapes too. I think my plan will be to start with this big circle in the middle. And as I practice that in the air, I feel that it's not an exact circle, it's a little more of an oval shape. So now that I've practiced it, I'm going to draw it on my sketchbook. I can sketch it, kind of whisper line it first. And now I observe further and I notice these two kind of wonky shapes off to the side. I think my plan is I'll start drawing this one first. So practice it in the air and then draw. Well, that was a lot of fun. Gunish Jeesh, artists, for working with puppets with us today. Gunish Jeesh, puppeteers. Over the next few weeks, you can make as many stories as you'd like. You could even invite an audience and do a puppet show for them. Have fun making found object art. And have fun puppeteering. See you later. See you later. See you later.